Falling bricks are big problems, and we were sent pictures of bricks which had fallen in dun downtown Youngstown. Now, that's when we went to check out this situation along Boardman Street, right in the heart of downtown. It turns out the, uh, the falling bricks, yeah, they pose a danger to uh, people walking by, even cars parked as well. Uh, 27 First News reporter Cameron O'Brien found out what's being done. She's live in the newsroom with more. Abigail Beniston is in charge of code enforcement for the city of Youngstown. I spoke with her this afternoon and she told me that that building has had code violations for the past two to three years. But the issue with the building's facade just started two to three months ago. This is video of 219 West Boardman Street in downtown Youngstown. As you can see, the facade of the building is starting to crumble and bricks are buckling out from the wall. But this scene is much better than it was earlier this week. A contractor cleaned up the scattered bricks you see in these photos we received earlier this week. Abigail Beniston says that the owner of this building is deceased and his estate is now in charge of the property. She says the city is working with the estate to get a resolution. We would like to see the building either repaired or demolished, but just rid of the safety factor. Abigail tells me that the fire chief has looked at this building and has determined it to be structurally sound. She says that the Mahoning County Buildings Department has been contacted as well. And Abigail also tells me that this is a larger part of the city's trying to clean up dilapid dilapidated buildings all around the city. It's a part of the revitalization of Youngstown. In the newsroom, Cameron O'Brien, WKBN 27 First News.